Hey guys, welcome back to Shade Review. In today's video, we are reviewing the Maui Jim Puka sunglasses. So first off, let's go ahead and pop these sunglasses on face and talk about the dimensions. So these sunglasses have 48 millimeter lenses and a 22 millimeter bridge. Now again, the name of these frames is Puka, which is Hawaiian for whole, because they actually have a ton of really small geometric apertures here on the frames, which look absolutely gorgeous when seeing these sunglasses in person. They really add a lot of detail and character to these frames, and I've never seen something like this done before on a pair of sunglasses. It just looks really nice and premium. I've seen a lot of nice etchings, which these also do have a lot of nice etchings on, but I've never actually seen these little you know apertures these little holes here on the frames and I think that is a really really cool design element now the reason Maui Jim was able to put holes in the frames is actually because these frames are made out of titanium on a normal pair of sunglasses it would actually you know kind of weaken the structural integrity of these frames but because these are titanium the metal is very strong and they're able to get away with this while having any issues to the structural again integrity of these frames which is really cool and it's really fun to see what Maui Jim's doing with their titanium titanium frames. Now because they are titanium, which is a metal material, these are extremely lightweight. They basically weigh almost nothing. They are basically weightless again. And because of that, you can wear these sunglasses for all day without any discomfort. These sunglasses are probably a third of the weight as a normal pair of Ray-Ban round sunglasses, which is very impressive. The frame core here is Maui Jim's matte silver, which looks really nice here on the titanium metal. And then the lenses here are Maui Jim's neutral gray lenses which have this really nice mirroring material to them and they also have this little dark layer here in the middle that way the sunglasses actually squint for you rather than you having to squint which really helps reduce eye strain. Maui Jim's lenses are definitely some of the best in the business and the lens material on the sunglasses are Maui Jim's Maui Brilliant lenses which are Maui Jim's most advanced lenses. They're extremely lightweight. They basically weigh almost nothing again which is really nice but they also have very very high clarity. The clarity on these is almost as clear as Maui Jim's super thin glass, which is definitely very impressive. Now let's go ahead and give you guys a quick comparison between these Maui Jim sunglasses and a pair of Ray-Ban round sunglasses. So this is the smallest size that Ray-Ban makes of the Ray-Ban round, and these have 47 millimeter lenses. And here we can see how these look on face. Again, these have more round off lenses, where these have more hexagonal lenses, I believe. Another feature that's really cool about these frames is here on the temples, they are actually flat. I know it's gonna be very hard to kind of show you guys this on camera, but these are actually flat temples here. So they aren't round like a normal pair of sunglasses, they are flat. And again, they do have these small little apertures here or openings here, which really add to the look of the frames and really make them stand out. Now, as far as build quality goes, these are built very, very solidly, considering that they are very lightweight. They are really nice and they feel very premium as well. They definitely don't feel like they're going to break very easily. These sunglasses do have fully adjustable nose rests and through the nose rest, they actually have a little uh, Maui Jim Bird logo for authentication purposes. They feature this single bridge design, but again, because they are made out of titanium, Maui Jim does a really good job. It doesn't feel like there's any give here whatsoever, so you don't have to worry about them flexing. There's actually way less give here on these Maui Jim sunglasses than there is on that pair of Ray-Ban sunglasses. Now these sunglasses are made in Japan. They sit here in the inner right temple of sunglasses. They just say Maui Jim made in Japan. Japan makes some of the finest uh, optical frames and uh, of course sunglass frames in the world. So that's really nice to see that these are made in Japan where the quality and build quality is very good. Now these sunglasses are definitely designed for people who have smaller heads, but honestly, I have a medium sized head. I actually think these sunglasses look really, really good on my face. Even though they do have that very small look to them, I still think I can pull these off. And, be and because of that, I think a lot of you guys are actually going to be able to pull off these sunglasses as well. So I definitely would recommend checking these out. Now the only downside of these frames is the price tag. These come in at $400, which is a lot of money for a pair of sunglasses. Even a pair of Maui Gym sunglasses, $400 is a lot of money it's definitely on the high end of their scale but again these are made out of titanium and the build quality and craftsmanship on these is definitely amazing they are made out of titanium and again all these little apertures here holes on the frames and the way that they did these flat temples that is very very hard to manufacture 
So these definitely cost a lot more to produce than the standard Maui Jim Mavericks, you know, their aviator style pair of sunglasses, which are also made out of titanium, but only cost $300. But as far as pricing goes, we usually can pick these up a little bit cheaper on Amazon. So I will leave a link in the description down below for you guys to pick up these sunglasses directly from Amazon, and they should be around $350. So you're not going to save too much money there, but I would recommend doing that because that brings these price tag of these just a little bit lower and a little bit more reasonable. But basically I have absolutely no complaints with these sunglasses other than the price. Now, as far as coverage from Sun goes, these actually offer very good coverage considering the fact that they are a round or hexagonal pair of sunglasses. So here up top, we can see there is a pretty big gap to the sunlight in unprotected. In here on the sides, again, there is a pretty big gap to the sunlight in protected. But this style of sunglass is never going to offer very good coverage. So considering the fact that they are this style, I think they have very good coverage compared to the competition. Well, that's all I got for you guys in this video. If you enjoyed it, make sure to give me a big thumbs up down below. And of course, make sure to subscribe button and then you'll be notified every single time about a brand new video just like this one to my YouTube channel. Again, thank you all so much for watching and I'll catch you all in the next one.